Hey, no, you? I'm good. What's good. happening? Finally, someone up my height. You see that? <laughs> this is just, I, I can't tell you how happy. That was something I was actually happy about working with Sam. Yes. He was taller than I expected. Yes. And it was good because it helped me work on my posture. Nice, nice. Whenever you're taller than people, you always do this. Yes. And it's just bad for you. It is, it is. It's bad I for them. Stand up straight. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. So um, tell us about your role as Reggie. I mean, I've seen the series, just really phenomenal. Thank you. Tell us about your role. Um, just playing opposite um, Sam as Ptolemy. I play Reggie, uh, Ptolemy's uh, nephew, who's also his caregiver. Mm -hmm. And he is someone who, if you read the book, you come to find that the backstory is, is he's somebody that was a cool uncle mm -hmm. when Reggie was a kid. Mm -hmm. He's somebody that took care of Reggie and taught him things about the world and about life. And now he's getting to return the favor. Uh, and he does this out of love, not out of obligation. Yes. And it's so beautiful to see something you don't see mm -hmm. in the in this particular storyline. You don't see it much on camera with this kind of intimacy with black men with black men. Mm -hmm. And to see that intergenerational uh, experience, this is what Reggie brings. Absolutely. And he becomes the catalyst to what happens for the rest of the story. Yes. Um, and this series touches on um, family, community, you know, aging and, and our memories, dementia, yeah. so many different things. And, you know, we all can kind of relate to having to take care of a family member at some point. Absolutely. And our fears of, you know, growing old and what, you know, what's going to happen. So what do you hope viewers kind of take away from this story? And why is it important for stories like this to be made? You know, I feel like what the filmmakers here were able to do was to deal with a very heavy subject and elevate you at the end of it and leave you with hope. And what I hope people bring from it is that whatever it is that you're going through, particularly with dealing with people that you care about that are in decline or decay, mm -hmm. you're not alone. Yes. And this is much more common than one would ex when one would think. Mm -hmm. And we got everybody and their mom out tonight. Everybody's here. <laughs> yeah. Don Cheeto. Yeah. Yeah. So, well, thank you. So, I hope you have a good evening. Uh, I already and, uh, have. Hope thank to, you. Yeah, I hope to talk to you again soon. All right, now. Bye. Bye.